Lima, 4,000. 2,600, 6,5 Lima. I would like to turn a little bit left to a line for 3, 4. A six six five nine Lima. I would like to turn a little bit left to align for runway three four. And left at one thousand six hundred six five Lima. Roger, we're still looking. Uh, we'll have to switch to other frequency for the light. Uh, if there's no traffic, we cancel with you five nine Lima. I will cancel with you for five ninety months. Your part, thank you, Chief Finding. Coming to offer with it. I can't see the other airport. I'm losing engine. Uh, five gun neighbors just hit the ground really hard as you flames. Yes, sir, I need to go orbit the section. They went down hard. They're in flames. Do you want me to orbit the section? Uh, stay, stay here and uh, stay 2500. He's about say, three miles right off my right side. I could orbit his section if you guys want. Yeah, but it looks like there's a structure of fire down there. It looks like he went to a building. Yeah, if you don't mind, I can go back over there and take a look for you guys. Maneuvering we'll back, and I'll let you know what's that. That's Tampa, Stalin 125. The crash is directly below me. Looks like they're into a house. I can't really tell. And there's still active planes down there and a lot of smoke coming from it. And uh, I will go back, I'll turn this back to east to west. Yeah, it's one two five, he is definitely into a house, the whole house looks like it's demolished. I could not, I just saw him going down at an extremely high rate of speed. Did not see any flames, I just saw his lights going down. Uh, it uh, looks like McMall and Booth, just uh, Behind like the lows, probably like a mile behind the lows, directly east of McMullen Booth. McMullen Booth and 60, about a mile, half a mile north of 60, and probably about a quarter mile east of McMullen Booth. I don't know. And for 125, you said 3,000 feet? Not a problem, just send it back 25, 25. 